Hi everybody, hope you're doing good. Today I want to talk about another psychic story that I wanted to bring to light because I found it to be so profound and beautiful. I had a reading with a mother and a daughter and they both came to my office in Chicago. And it was interesting because they wanted to make contact with, well, her husband, her father. This great lady that I love so much she had tragically lost her husband so suddenly and it was in front of her and she tried every way that she could to save him he had a heart attack and it was very profound for her to witness that and for those of you that have had to witness someone you love pass right in front of you it is very tragic so he came through beautifully he stepped forward and i just loved everything about him and he had messages for his daughter and he had a lot of messages for his wife. But the one thing that I kept seeing was he kept showing me a card. And it was interesting. It had writing on it. And I said to her, "Is I keep seeing something that he wrote you. She looked at me and she goes, well, what do you mean? And I said, I don't know, but I keep getting a card. So she says, tell me more. I says, well, it's a card that he wrote. And it's interesting because he's telling me that everything that's in this card that he wrote, he meant every word and then some. But he keeps talking about this one specific card. She looked at me and she started to sob. She just put her whole face in her hand and started to cry and I just waited and the daughter's looking at me and the daughter knew exactly, but I think she wanted her mother to tell me the story. So I waited until she composed herself and interesting enough, she told me when she was cleaning out the closet and there was a box and in the box came out one card in an envelope, but the envelope now was sealed. So the card came stumbling and it fell at her feet and she's looking at it like, what the heck is this? And it had her name on it, but the card had never been opened. She opened up this card and it was a card that he wrote when they were in high school together. She started to read the card and he was just telling her how she made him feel and that he was a better person because he met her and he just wanted to spend the rest of his life with her. And there were so many beautiful things in the card that he was professing his love for her. Ironically, she never read the card because he never gave it to her. The card was sealed and she opened up that card and she just started reading it, crying, loving it. And all she could think of is why didn't she ever get that card earlier? And I said, because it was meant for you to have that card with the way that you found it, your husband was showing you and he's still speaking to you. It touched me beyond words. Timing, I always say, is very, very crucial. And spirit has a way of letting us know at the right time what we're supposed to know. Remember that. And I always say, never look for it. Let them find you because they will find you in a very profound way. And they will see to it that whatever it is they want you to know, you will know it through a dream through something in front of you or like this wonderful woman finding a card that was over 40 years ago that this man wrote to her but never gave her. Is it coincidence? No. So I wanted to share that because she looked at me and she goes, what you gave me today is everything. And I said, I was just here to verify everything. She goes, you know what though? We need people like you because we need people. We need affirmation that comes only from you that you can give us. And she says, and for that, I'm grateful. And she says, can I hug you? And I said, absolutely. And I hugged her tight. I'm a hugger anyway. Hugged her, I hugged her daughter. What a beautiful family I thought this was when I was talking to both of them. But what a beautiful soul her husband is. And I tell you, it makes it, you know, some days are very hard for me too. I'm not gonna lie to you. There's a lot of days when I'm tired. 
because the stories are so sad and so profound, but they do get to me. And when I can have a story like this that I can bring to you, it's beautiful. It's everything, even for me. So I wanted to thank him, and I did. When his wife and daughter left, I thanked him for coming through, and I thanked him for the beautiful message that he possessed to his wife because through that, that card, and you know what, 40 years, I'm sure he's written lots of cards to her and letters, but never like this one. This was probably the most special. Why? Because at the time that it made its way to her and how bad she needed it. So I love the psychic story. I love all of these stories that I, that I receive from so many of you. And I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart each and every day. So please have faith because a little faith goes a long way and never give up and realize one day when you're least expecting it, spirit will make its way for you to find what you need to see. Okay. So I hope this helped you subscribe to my platform, Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram, and more stories will be coming until then. Have a very blessed week. All the best to all of you. Bye-bye. Oh, 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 oh,